What up, what up, it's Dane and in this video I'm going to be telling you how to lose fat in one day at home. Okay, I'll be giving you four steps in order to lose fat fast. Step number one is reduce carbohydrate intake, right? So what you need to understand is that for every one gram of carbohydrate, you have four grams of water is held to that molecule, right? So in other words, carbs hold water, right? So step number one is definitely to reduce the carbs. An example meal for breakfast would be an omelette with veggies in and just keep that breakfast high protein a lot of vegetables and you should be good to go okay step number two is drink more water right and it sounds a bit controversial I know you drinking more water you're adding more weight but that's not how the body works right the more water you drink the more water will flush out your system right so definitely step number two drink a lot more water you might hear people say oh I want to get dry I want to reduce my water intake yes but you don't before that, they drank like two gallons of water per day, right? So a lot of water to get that shit out of your body. But one more tip, probably don't drink a lot of water before you go to bed because that will affect your sleep. You will get up in the middle of the night to have a piss, right? Okay, step number three, this is the big one. Reduce sodium consumption, right? So what's sodium? Sodium is basically found in, these are high sodium food sources. So salt, that's not a food source anyway, but salt sources and spices, right? They're really, really high in sodium, so avoid them at all cost sodium basically fluctuates water retention meaning you can eat a meal that's like only got any sodium in then the rest of the day you eat meals of high sodium your water retention is going to be through the roof you add like 10 pounds to the scale so definitely reduce sodium when you cook foods don't add spices don't add excuse me too many sauces and just be real careful with your sodium consumption just go without salt for this one day right Okay, so the last step is to sweat the water out, right? You can do this by going in a sauna for like 10 to 15 minutes. Um, you can do it by going in a steam room. You can do it by doing high intensity interval training. Uh, it doesn't really matter if you do it before breakfast or after breakfast. So faster cardio, fed cardio, it doesn't really matter. I would probably advise doing it in the start of, like in the morning before breakfast. That's just my recommendation. Uh, more ways to sweat out is more clothes wear more clothes increase your temperature feel warmer sweat more that's basically all the steps you need to know on how to sweat out water right so those are the four steps in order to lose fat in one day at home right but before before we click off the video i need to tell you something really important this is only for one day you need to understand this you can't do this all day every day it's not a flexible diet right it's just for one day you're not going to want to eat foods that low in sodium all the time because you're just going to end up cheating on your diet. It's going to be rubbish food, right? And you're not going to want to wear loads of clothes in the summer to sweat, like stuff like this. This is just for one day. And the most important factor when it actually comes to weight loss is calorie deficit, right? If you're in a calorie deficit, you will lose weight. But the main purpose of this video was to reduce water retention. And water retention is probably one of the biggest factors when it comes to fat loss. Hence why I covered it and how to lose Wait in one day at home, right? So, or fat, or whichever you want to call it. I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure to subscribe to the channel if you find it useful. Comment down below. Stay positive, stay smiling, and I'll see you in the next one.